Well, good morning. Today is a really special day. Today we are getting a delivery of 520 bare root fruit trees. So I'm really excited about that. And to make the berms, I'm going to be using this three point better attachment that I got with Kubota. And I tested it out, it actually works really good. I tested it out in the, the back of my property and it makes really good berms. Well, check it out. These are the two little berms I made. They're coming along pretty good. The little tractor is doing a really good job. This is the setup I'll be using to plant trees. The trees will be sitting a little bit higher than the ground so that the water doesn't, you know, get into the roots and sit there and waterlock the trees. So the truck is going to be here any minute with 520 fruit trees. They're going to be in bins that have to be lifted with a forklift. And my neighbor said he has a forklift that he'll help me with, but he's not picking up. So I don't know what I'm going to do. Well, the trees are here. Well, the truck is here and each one of these bins weigh 1,000 pounds. So there's no way I can lift it with my little Kubota tractor. I really need my neighbor to show up with the, with the forklift. I keep calling him, but I think he probably forgot. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. All right, good news. I finally got hold of my neighbor. He was in his farm, so he wasn't getting good reception there. But I finally got hold of him and he's coming over with that forklift. Well, my neighbor is here. Glad to see him. When he said forklift, I wasn't expecting this beast. This is a monster. Army forklift. That thing can lift 10,000 pounds. It's amazing. Jagmeet Singh, Daisy Creek Farms. Well, all the trees are here. 520 trees, and we'll be planting them pretty soon. There are going to be winds in a couple of days, so I don't want to plant these trees when we have, you know, a lot of winds coming in. After the weather is a little bit calmer, it's probably going to be in about three to four days. That's when I'm going to have a couple of guys help me and plant these trees. Well, there are the trees. Well, trees are inside the shop. I want to keep them inside away from the sunlight because I don't want the trees to start waking up before we plant them. Well, I didn't tighten it all the way. There's a little leak. Oh, there you go, that should fix it. So when, when we got these bare trees, they come covered in sawdust. I think I can use the sawdust in uh, in composting as well. This is a really good source of carbon. It's like 500 to 1 or 800 to 1 ratio of carbon, carbon to nitrogen ratio. So it does wonder in you know, creating a hot compost. 
However, the next step now is to start watering these trees because we don't want them to dry out. There you go, 520 trees have been delivered and the next step is to start planting these trees. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in another video.